Okay, so there's some new information that is coming out of this world of Power Rangers and on one hand, I agree and I understand this decision as to why they're doing it. On the other hand, I'm trying to figure out is how do you make sense out of that situation because of what Hasbro is doing in terms of like entertainment and stuff. There is a lot of theories going around what, what's been going on with the auction and why this and that is happening. So, shout out to Rangers Universe Latino America. Always, you always put out information for me to cover this. Entertainment One changes to Lionsgate Canada. This name change comes after Hasbro sold the entertainment division to E1. It acquired in 2019 to Lionsgate in 2023. Hasbro's hand E1 was in charge of producing the Dino Fury and Cosmic Fury seasons. Also, the 25th Raw well, 30th Anniversary Special once and always, it was going to be in charge of the cancel Power Rangers reboot along with Netflix. So I want to break down two things that I noticed in this part. One, they pretty much just said that it's going to be called Lionsgate Canada. In my theory, I personally believe that it's going to be filmed in Canada now. Because we went from Los Angeles to New Zealand for 20 years, and now we could possibly be filming in Canada. Much like how the 2017 movie was, even though that film was hot garbage. But it makes sense because Amy Jo Johnson lives in Canada now. So, if this is true that Power Rangers is going to be filming in Canada from now on, then I think it's safe to say that a lot of our theories were right on long. Because when we found out that Power Rangers was no longer going to be filming in New Zealand after 20 years in the Disney era, and in the, the Nino Saban and the Hasbro era and whatnot, we could end up getting some different eras of Power Rangers in Canada, depending on how good the CGI is because if it's anything like New Zealand in terms of like bad CGI when it looks like it was like you know PS2 graphics and something like that then I don't want it I don't want it but if they have a good CGI in Canada in terms of like films and TV shows is concerned I would like to think that it might be the case if they do have some good CGI for Power Rangers sign me up but none of this confirmed that Power Rangers is filmed in Canada. It's going to be the new home for Power Rangers. It's just Lionsgate naming their brand Lionsgate Canada. So that could be the case that Power Rangers could end up being filmed in Canada based on this information. And the next part that I wanted to correct is the 25th anniversary it's not 25th it's 30th anniversary just so you know but i do understand where you're coming from with this though and then i'm also finding out that they're no longer putting money in films and tv shows like transformers and gi joe or my little pony it's just going to be basically focusing on train car games and toys and stuff like that but yet they're doing many more of the power when just readers rewind and they're doing and working with boom studios on power Ranger comics so here is my question to hasbro hammers the bond so all of his rights to power which is to you and now all of a sudden you just said f you to the fans giving us a middle finger because you didn't want Power Rangers. I'm not saying that you did you didn't want, but it really got us thinking like that, Hasbro. Like, what's up? So I'm not saying that you didn't want Power Rangers. I'm saying that you could have like throw some money into this show. So now you're not gonna be throwing any more money on Transformers and all the other franchises based on your IPs, which doesn't make any sense because you bought Power Rangers for a million dollars and now all of a sudden you don't want 
you know, do nothing with it. I'm trying to help make it make sense out of this situation because Chris Cox, I'm sorry, but that dude, he needs to go. He's doing horrible. He's not keeping the fans updated on Power Rangers. It just seems like he doesn't care. Like it was all about the money. Listen, I understand that because of the auction, you wanna make some money. And yeah, I'm gonna do a video on that after this video. But if you brought all of that money back, I think what you need to do is go back to filming Power Rangers and throw some money in and you are a million dollar company. So what are you afraid of Hasbro? If not, then Lionsgate is gonna end up doing it. Like I'm calling it right now.